listen, listen. They don't you tell no lies in church just because people tell you to look at your neighbor. If they don't line up with what you believe and if it don't line up with your confession, if it ain't your testimony, don't say it. So I'm about to tell you to say something, but if it ain't your testimony, don't say it. Tell somebody, I could have died in what I was in. Because I know some people who did. I don't judge them. I'm just grateful because I could have died. That's why this I recall to my mind. get swallowed up in it I need you to touch three people and tell them it could have been different my outcome could have been different I could have been locked up in that jail right now died with a needle in my arm Woo. I could have died in what I was in I could have died in what I was in I could have died in what I was in I could have died in what I was in I could have died in what I was in could have died in what I was in. Every once in a while, you got to think about it. You didn't have to come to church. You get to go to church because I could have died. I could have died in what I was in. We ought to praise God because in 11 years, we haven't buried not one pastor. We could have died in what I need you to take about a hundred of y'all and just start dancing for what you know about. Go ahead. sensitive to the time now we got some flights to catch and I could have died in what I was in and that's not a cliche I'm not talking about hypothetically if God had stepped in when he did I would have had a different outcome I live to get to my ordination I live to see convocation
praise the media. Go ahead and praise them adjutants. Praise them ushers. Y'all been serving all week. I heard what you said, Joshua Latis. Ain't nothing left to do but praise him. Hey! Ain't nothing left to do but praise him. Woo. Maybe trying to figure out what your dancing is all about. Tell somebody, I thought about it. I thought about it. I thought about it. Psalm that says, when I think of the goodness, I ain't even got to have a full conversation. I'm praising them all for two things, a flashback and a flash forward. But hey! y'all said by the time we get back together, we coming back with the evidence that I wasn't jumping just to be jumping. I'm coming back with the receipts. I'm coming back with the proof that he did everything he said he was going to do. Everything God said. And everything else he said. And everything else he said. Praise him, Dickie Jasmine. Praise him. Praise him. If somebody near you dancing, call that name. Tell him, praise him. We encourage people and everything else. Tell somebody. Encourage them in that praise. Praise him, Rachel. Praise him. Hey, praise him. forward. Praise the Pastor Marvin. I'm looking in your future. I see your forward. You're not going to die here. I'm looking in your future. And you in a better place. I'm looking in your future. You in a healthy place. I'm looking at you in your future. And you in a safe space. Everybody shout. They praising them in the back, all right? Balcony, don't y'all, don't y'all let them get the blessing without you. Everybody get up under this cloud. Get up under this cloud. Get up under this cloud. Woo. Hey. Get the seven people tell them, I see you, I see you. I've seen your present pain. I've seen your present conflict. I've seen your present contradiction. I've seen your present challenges. But as I see you, I'm also seeing you in the future. And in the future, it's behind you. Hey, in the future, it's a reference point. Ha. In the future, what you thought was gonna kill you in the present, all it did was anoint you. Somebody in this room, you've been anointed with an affliction. You've been anointed by your affliction. Glory be to God. And what was on your back? And what was on your back is officially under your feet. The devil is defeated and God is exalted. The devil is defeated and God is exalted. Get to your seat as quickly as you can. The devil is defeated. And God 
is exalted. Hug somebody, tell them I see you in the future. Now, just in case somebody in this room, like, hold on, you told me not to say it. If it don't line up with me, how do I supposed to see them in the future? Well, our future is wrote out in the scriptures. So I really do see you in the future. When I flip the pages of the apocalyptic text of the book of Revelation, when John said, I saw 144,000, John asked the angel, who are they? They're 12,000. 12,000 from the tribe of Asher. 12,000 from the tribe of Benjamin, Dan, Ephraim, and Manasseh. Judah, Nephtali, Zebulon. But then he said, I looked up and I saw an, another group of people. Now these are 144,000, but this is a number that no man can number. And John said to the angel, well, who are they? He says, these are they who come through great tribulation. I see you in the future. Tell somebody, I saw you in the future. And what you thought was going to kill you turned around and blessed you. We are there. We are there. We are there. No, 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 Somebody clearing out the path. Hey, hey. Somebody clearing out the path. Hey. Well, I don't know what they've been going through. Go ahead and help them. Go ahead and help them. Thank you. Amen. We're coming. Pastor Scott's son. Go ahead and praise Go, go. 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 Hey. Come on, we're apostolic church. Clap your hands. Come on. I see myself in something I thought I would never get past. Something I thought I would never overcome. I see myself. You're not moving. 
Speak in the spirit. Come on. 
need a vacation. You need this Elijah. You need this Elijah. Because I know you want to quit. But there are more kings you got to coronate. I know you want to resign. But there are more prophets you got to raise. I know you want to walk away from the ministry. You look good on the outside. But you're dealing with your contradictions on the inside. But 